Not sure if it was Cop then, but uh, let's keep our cameras on this because it's like a sand touch. Very keen to get into this. Fighting out of his at the moment. That's exactly what Big Spider Everett needs to do, and he did it beautifully. He's a big man to get in there, fly the flag. <laughs> And you've got to develop some spirit amongst the team, particularly if you've had a bad year. And, uh, that, oh, he's going at it. That's a free kick, surely. Yep, free Zantuck. kick. Zantuck. Zantuck is going crazy here. He's lost the clock, right? He has lost the clock. He's just been reported. And I tell you what, it's not over yet. He and Spider started initially, and he has momentarily lost the clock. He has, and uh, Richie Vandenberg just wanders in. Wayne Campbell now, and they've got to get Zantuck off on him. Vandenberg's got to get out because they've got the free kick. They're going to get a, a double shot goal here. Well, it's just a fair to whether, whether Richie can trust himself. He can get in there and get in his face. He's just got to be able to trust himself. Yeah, you want to give the umpires a reason to turn it around, though, Gary, do you? This is a good move. Zantuck needs just to have a breather. And then you're getting back on within a couple of minutes. But just a quick word on the phone from Danny Frawley. Spider giving him a nice verbal send-off as well. Here it is. And that's the... That's what's called a jumper punch, I think, Brian. And a bit of a just shake the rag doll at the end as well. Jumping punch. Williams comes in for his second goal in 30 seconds. And has missed from directly in front. Well, we want Zantuck back on because he's certainly put a little bit of life into the game. Although there's nothing wrong with the game. And uh, here we are again. Let's just watch this one. That's what it was for. And a little bit of a, oh. bit of a shake. Lucky it wasn't a concrete oval. 